Now, hello, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's a good day. I've just woken up. It's a Monday today, on the date of July 4th. The time of recording this video, as you can see, my watch say there. So, I've woken up this morning. Uh, I woke up a little bit earlier, prepared some porridge and uh for breakfast you know i love porridge with age you will come to realize that porridge is very important so right now i've woken up as you can see my house um i've tried putting it in order so here i have my laptop i was just going through it for some reasons that are best known by me this is my youtube account uh, thank God we are growing very well. We are on the road to 11,000 subscribers. My PayPal has been acting up. My PayPal has been acting up and it's really worrying me because you can see it says I have zero balance, but down here it says money has been placed on hold. Now, one of you sent me money to help me with my, uh, you know, my YouTube and lifestyle uh, videos. Unfortunately, um, PayPal decided to hold it and they've been holding it they're enjoying keeping it there and we are suffering I need money honestly but they've refused to release it they're keeping it there for 180 days I don't know why is it so PayPal sometimes becomes very tricky I don't know whether it happens that way worldwide or it's because I don't know all the specific people that it happens to so it has worried me because that's a lot of money i can't access that money until 180 days you know 180 days is six months anyway that aside um tomorrow at night i'm supposed to travel home not actually home but on on my hometown there are some documents we are going to work on and so i'm going to travel with my stepbrother who's also here in nairobi and we are going to meet with my other stepbrother in uh, Mbita and my mom. We are going to open a bank account, a joint bank account for our family. Uh, there are issues about family that maybe I may not be comfortable sharing with you, but uh, at the right time I will. So, because of my traveling tomorrow, I did laundry. I washed. Let me go confirm if my clothes actually dried. So this is the porridge that I prepared. I'm waiting for it to get cold so that we can take it. These are my containers. As I told you, I, I did laundry. Mm -hmm. So They've dried. I washed them yesterday. Mm -hmm. So I've just confirmed. Some are dry, some are not yet dry. So we'll just give them time. We still have the whole day. Eh, these things are squeezing me here. I'm struggling to walk in. So I just have to pack on time. I'm not going for many days. I'm just going for one or two days. That's why I had to wash a few clothes. I have to pack uh, and then get ready for the journey tomorrow. There are a few things that I have to go with. I bought my mom this. Uh, electric uh, blender for juice as you can see how it looks like see i bought her this one it's gonna help her with her blendings and what and what it's from the itel company i don't know how it works yeah and i'm also going to get another luggage from my uncle's place that i will travel with so for now, uh, I just have to work and today. I have to work the whole day editing and editing and editing until where I will get tired and then that is when I will do the packing. I usually prefer packing early 
I'm not planning to go with my laptop. I'm going just to leave it. So for that that reason, I'm going to go with the um, you know external drive. So I will shoot content and uh, transfer them to the external drive and just name them day one, day two, day three. Perfect. So this video is basically about packing and informing you that we are traveling to Mbita. Mbita is so far from Nairobi, very far. Like uh, uh, traveling takes you about 10 to 12 hours. Yeah, I think so. So I will prefer traveling in the night so that I arrive in the morning, do what took me there, and then in the evening again, board another car back to Nairobi. That's a lot of sitting, a lot of sitting. All right. Okay, so guys, as you can see, I want to book for uh, a car. Nowadays, we can do it online, and then uh, on the day of traveling, you can just go and print your receipt. So as you can see, this website, it's called uh, buupass.com booking so here you book you uh, you can book buses you can book trains flights and even hotels so for us you're going to book buses i'm traveling with my brother he's just sending me money right now to do the booking so here it's indicating from where to where so from nairobi to uh let me say mbita with this app it, you just write your destination and where you're coming from it will select a bus for you where you can then you click search after searching like this it recommended easy coach yeah so we have two buses the first one leaves at 7 45 p.m and the second one leaves at 21 the 21 is uh, i think that is 9 9 p.m yeah, this one leaves at, uh, at 9 p.m. This one leaves at 7.45 a.m. Okay. I think this is the one that we are going to use. It leaves at 9 p.m. and arrives at 5.45 a.m. So, I will select seat. I'll go ahead and book. So, they are, the, the, the darker, the darker, you know, colors means they have already been taken. I'll prefer this one. 5a and 5b so as you see down here it says proceed to book it's 2200 for two people so first name that is my details Devans Orwa uh, 0701 so I've already filled everything correct here so it's time to pay as you can see 5a and 5b so I go to go to payments and then these are the details I'm paying through M-Pesa okay so I'm just paying it's supposed to reflect on my phone here you see it has come so it says, do you do you want to pay 2,200 to Easy Coach Limited for account and Tempesa pin? Yes. As you see here, it indicates booking successful. That's the Impesa message. I'm so broke. I don't have money to come back to Nairobi. <laughs> okay. God will provide. So here it says we've done the booking. Debans or where I will take five eight close to the window, and then my brother will take the seat beside me. So that is done. That is done. So the remaining thing is to go and print a ticket. As you can see, I have booked the receipt confirmed. So I have to. Uh, I'll pick the receipt tomorrow back home. So this place has a lot of destruction, like now here, that lorry. I've decided to go out here in the balcony. That is me. That is me, yo. I love this day. Let me show you out here. This is on the other side. As you can see, there is a lorry actually bringing water into this place. Oh, it's so very noisy. 
this place is so dirty. I usually take a long time without coming to this place out here. Especially this cold season, so I've been locking this door. Let me try making it organized. I'm just done uh, cleaning this place. I was just doing a rough work, like just juju. I will clean on another particular day. If I don't check out that dust, it becomes... Uh, it actually gets into the house, making me have a lot of work. It's very dusty. What's falling in this speaker? Okay, it's Sony. Okay. So now, let's go edit. It's time for editing. Time for editing. Oh, what's this one that is breaking my look dirty. Okay. Let's now settle edit as I charge my phone. I'm going to edit with the other the, the desktop. This one I will just shut it like this and it will sleep and save power. Okay. Yo, so good evening. Uh, good evening. <clears throat> As me, I'm collecting this purpose. I'm in studio. Security first. So I've just come to studio because of, I've come to collect something of mine. Meanwhile, these ones can just be in the kitchen area. I'm just putting this bean peppers under here. That's where they're placed. So. Mm, I've passed by this place so that I can collect uh, my external disc, which is this one. This one is an external disc. It's called Transcend. It's supposed to help with the storage when I go home because I'm not going to carry the laptop. The laptop is too heavy. I can't walk with uh, about 6 kgs on my back. I've not yet even put clothes and maybe other th few things. So I will uh, I will just go with this one. I record videos and once I feel my storage is full, I will transfer them here. So when I come back to Nairobi, I will edit them and sort them the way they are supposed to be. I'm also <clears throat> supposed to go to my uncle's place to go and collect something. I'm just waiting for a phone call from them to tell me that they've arrived. They're still at work. It's actually... Uh, What's the time? Let me show you. It's actually very late. 9.56 p.m. Imagine. Four minutes to ten. Security in this place, not so good. So I have to be fast. So I'm from my uncle's place. And this is what I went to get. I don't know. It's called a baby, baby walker. It helps uh, the baby walk. Yeah, so it's, it works that way. I don't want to show you because uh, folding it takes time. So this is the way it looks like. Perfect, so my stepbrother will have something to help him learn how to walk. I have to sleep now, it's already very late. As you can see the time, it's 11.08 p.m. I gotta sleep right now. Hey yo, so this is another day. I'm doing uh, cloth folding right now. Uh, the clothes I washed on the previous day. So I'm just folding them and then I pack for my traveling. 
So I'll finish uh, arranging the clothes first and then I can proceed. So guys, it's time to pack. Time to pack. Time to pack my things. It's um, it's almost 3 p.m. I'm supposed to leave this house at around 6 p.m. or maybe 7 because I'll have two more hours. So this is the bag I'm going to use to carry my property. It's a laptop bag. I bought it for my laptop, but unfortunately it couldn't fit. My laptop is bigger than this. So here I mostly pack my electronics, the cameras and what and what. I also use this other bag for the GoPro. It's also strong as you can see it has uh, my essentials for recording. This is storage, this is light, this is just tape for an emergency. This is some Vaseline that is very important when your lips are dry and also for makeup. I have uh, two power banks here, you can see because uh, I must have enough power okay so that is it for this bag I think no I'm forgetting the charges very important I have to carry my USB chargers for the other ones I will still leave them because I'm still using them I'm just going for a day so this one I'd prefer to keep it in here like this so that it can just be safe so when I do that then I shut this place like this perfect like that I'll carry this small bag also just for the sake I might want to move around and then for dressing I don't have much I'll carry this uh, windbreaker uh actually i am i'm going to carry clothes because i'm not going to spend the night anyway but these are what i'll wear maybe i may carry one vest for an emergency this one but for the traveling i will need uh, this trouser jeans this pair of windbreaker and a vest this is enough so when i travel tonight this is what i'll wear then this is what I'll wear the following day with this uh, sweater and jumper. We are sorted, we are done. So that is it for my packing. I'm gonna shoot my videos with the, with the two uh, cameras. The GoPro, the GoPro camera, as well as my iPhone that I'm using currently to shoot now. I have three phones. One, the one that I'm using the camera, I have this one for my M-Pesa and this other one is for communication with my clients. It fell down so bad yesterday, it got broken. So, these are my chargers, I'll pack them later. And uh, that's all for now. Let's uh, prepare Mbita, see you in a few. Yo, so, um, time to leave the house has just come. It's already... <laughs> I'm always getting late when it comes to traveling, leaving the house. 7.16 p.m. So we still have two hours to catch up the car because the, our vehicle leaves at exactly 9. So we were asked to arrive 30 minutes before time to print receipts. So if I leave now, I'm sure that I'll be in town in the next 30 to 1 hour so that I can have enough time to walk to the stage, go print all those things and get ready. I'll meet my stepbrother in town. I don't know whether I'll vlog. It might be dark, but still the same. I'm gonna see what I can do. So I'm gonna miss my house. Like, um, <clears throat> see there, I improvise things here. 
look at that one up there. This is how my house today looks like. I've tried cleaning it. There are no that utensils here. So I think I'm the luckiest person. So <clears throat> let me travel and uh, I'll talk to you when I get to Mbita in the morning. Okay. Guys, I'm at the stage right now. Guys, I'm lucky I came on time. I've already done the receipt printing as you can see. This is uh, mine. It has my details here. The car is supposed to leave at uh, 9. And then the one down here is my brother's. He is not yet here. As you can see, there are two receipts. So I'm currently at the waiting room. This is how it looks like. We are so many. Those traveling, the buses are outside here. It's currently 8 10. I still have 40 more minutes to go. Actually, 50. Almost one hour. Nini Kama hiyo hoteli haifani leo Huko juu Kama tuwene tu kwa hiyo ya tenu Isi nikone tuwe nti Mi staki kukula eni kuhu Na rock Sire Kitambo ni kwa tubikula nyama na haribikiwa Sini kasema na nitaanza kukula chilipo Nikinu nwezi chilipo Hai zina ni haribikia Kwa njiyo siku zili ni haribikia mimi na So guys, I'm in Mbita, I'm in Mbita, Mama Land, I'm in Mbita, we just arrived a few minutes ago at uh, 5.45, uh, 
45, 46 uh, I mean the money just the way they indicated when they received so now I'm in beta I'm just walking towards the ferry section let me show you wow so this is the ferry terminus and see there it has different uh, ferries on it So that's an indication that it's about to leave. Yeah. Wow. There are so many. Let me show you. It's also sunrise. See how they look like? Yeah. So um I I am at the lake. I'm at the lake right now, as you can see. The sun is rising behind me. That is the sound of water. Let me not see a crocodile or a hippo here. <laughs> I fear crocodiles. They, they will kill you. Oh, the water bus is on the other side. Somewhere. You know that's visible? No, it can't zoom. So, uh, allow me end this video here. It's already long. Uh, so that I can see you in the next one. So, this is Mbita. Mbita is my hometown. I come from Pangano Island. There are many islands in it. So as you can see, if I turn the camera, you see those black mountains there? Those are uh, actually islands. So I'm home, I'm just waiting for, the, for, 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 for businesses to open. Most businesses open at 8 p.m. 8 a.m. I mean, sorry. And then we can start what brought us here and then we go back home. So guys, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and turn on the notification bell to be notified every time we upload videos on our YouTube channel. Until next time, always work hard and be nice to people. And remember that nothing is impossible.